All right, guys, today I am in Venice, Florida, and what do I spy with my little eye but an abandoned Albertsons grocery store? Look at this. There's a plane flying above, but look at this, guys. Yeah, this is an Albertsons grocery store, and uh, if you look close at the front here, actually the angle I'm showing you right now, you can see the label scar where it says Albertsons. I hope you can hear me over that stupid plane up there. Go away plane, I don't love you. Excuse me, sir, you're interrupting my video. Could you tone it down a little? <laughs> yeah, so I don't know if we're gonna be able to see in here. We're gonna try to take a peek, but these look like the windows are kind of uh, blacked out. Ooh, maybe not, look at this. Yeah, pretty cool. Big empty grocery store. You can see wall to wall. Let's see if I can lock some of this out here. Yeah, check that out. That's pretty cool, guys. Hold on, let me take a look without the camera. Okay, yeah, so that's what I was looking for. Back here on the wall, yeah, you can see where it says meat there. Meat, the meat market. And then over here on this side, where is it? It says produce, if you can see that. And then over on the other side here, uh, I believe it says cosmetics. I don't know if you can see that or not, but yeah. Yep, cool. They got the lights on in there still. That's where the, uh, what do you call them, checkouts were right there. Let's see if we can see anything different down here. Wait a minute, look, you can still see the sign up here, the Albertsons thing. Forget something, choose to reuse. Bring in your shopping totes. And look at this. Oh, here we got another Albertsons thing. Welcome to Albertsons. Pretty cool, look at this, look how weathered that is, oh my gosh. Open seven to, tw seven to 11, seven days a week. All right, let's look down here, see if we can see anything else through this side. Thank you for shopping at Albertsons, pretty cool. Yeah, I can't really see anything more, but pretty cool. I'm not really all that familiar with Albertsons because they're not in my area. So I don't know, but this uh, stone pattern here, that might be specific to Albertsons. Anybody who knows, let me know because that is a pretty cool design there. I really like that. Let's see if we can see anything through here. I think we can, yep, a little bit. Front doors there. Yep, too much of a glare to see too much in there, but Here's where it says cosmetics. I think that's what it says. I got a pretty bad glare here, but. All right, let's keep on going down here and look. Another thing I noticed was the uh, the way this different style of uh, concrete up here. I don't know if that's specific to Albertsons. Again, if you guys know, let me know, because that's pretty cool. I love stuff like that. You know, you can always tell when you go to some of these places just by looking at the design. And uh, maybe this is specific to Albertsons. I gotta feel this. That is pretty cool. That's legit individual rocks in there, guys. Smashed into the concrete. Look at that. Pretty cool. Let's take a quick walk around the building here. See if there's anything else to see. Here's the big empty parking lot here. Just a big truck and an RV over there. RV uh, driving school. Oh look, we have a cart. Harbor Freight Tools. Okay, yeah, so there's not a whole lot down there. I don't think I'm gonna go around to the back of the building, but looks like, yeah, there's like a gate back there anyway, but all right, well, let me get a picture of it from out here in the parking lot for you guys. Yeah, there we go. And if you look through the trees there at the entrance, you can see the Albertsons. Uh, label scar again it looks like there was a label scar up here from something but I can't quite make out what it would have said I'm assuming something like food or pharmacy or something like that I don't know but yeah the Albertsons uh, label scar up here is pretty prominent you can see that real clear that looks really cool I love that picture right there Albertsons. Yep, there you can see it right there. Like in person, it's a little bit more difficult to actually see, but uh, but I can see that on the camera here, it sticks out a little bit better. 
and see right where all the letters were there. Pretty cool. And then up here on this side as well, you can tell where there was some kind of label up there, lettering or something. I have no clue. I would have to look it up. I might even be able to find this place on uh, Google Earth, on Google Maps, and get an actual picture of what it looked like uh, before it closed. If I can find that, I'll put it in here. Let me just look around the side over here real quick, just in case there's anything cool. Hold on now. We're getting there. We are getting there. Looks like there's another door. All right, we have to go take a peek. I can't stand it. I just had to step back here for a minute and get a shot like this, because look how cool that looks, guys. I love that right there. <laughs> that is such a cool picture. All right, let's go over here and look at the other entrance. Okay, yeah, looking at this side here, you can see the Albertsons uh, label scar right there. And then as we move down here, you can see where up here it said liquor. I'm not exactly sure what that one said there, though. I can't quite make it out. If you guys can figure out what that says, let me know. Well, let's go ahead and take a peek in these uh, windows and doors here. They have some of them blacked out in the front, but I love when they don't have all of them blacked out and you can actually look and see in a little bit. Yeah, look at that. Okay, there's a wide shot. But look at this. What's it say? Thank you for shopping or something? I don't know what... Oh, maybe that just said Albertsons. I don't know. It looks like there was something there, but now it's just a label scar. Let's go over to this one real quick, and then we'll get out of here. Maybe the liquor store was separate. Okay, apparently it still was Albertsons, but it was, it was a separate store. Looks like you could maybe enter from the store. I don't know. Sometimes liquor stores have different uh, rules that you have to follow. Can't really see a lot in there because of the reflection. But pretty cool nonetheless. And yeah, I would have to guess that this whole design here, all the, uh, all the stones and all that, and that kind of stone work up there at the top, I would have to guess that that is probably specific to Albertsons. So if you guys know, let me know. This has been a pretty cool look at that store there. Stick around. I'm still going to do this kind of content in between the Christmas things and lots of other stuff. I just love being out here filming all kinds of different things, guys. So catch you later.